Caught on camera, crooks in the act, stealing tires off a car in the middle of the night. The wheels and tires gone. And these families in Southwest Houston are furious their cars were left on blocks. It's an all too common crime. Chris Costa is standing for Houston. Looks at how you can protect yourself from becoming the next victim. This is how Austin Carden found his car Thursday morning. Wheels and tires gone, sitting on cinder blocks. Police say you can't completely prevent thieves from stealing your wheels but you can slow them down. So they showed up looking for wheels and that's all they took. Austin Carden says a few other families in this neighborhood also got hit by wheel thieves. I've been finding these around the driveway for most of the uh, day. What is it? Just pieces, uh, pieces of the lug nuts coming off the car. It won't be cheap to replace, I know that much. And they steal expensive wheels all the time. That's some money. Mechanic Anthony Stoker hears this same story multiple times a week. He can strip a set of wheels in less than two minutes. Criminals working together can move even faster. It's, it's scary to think that something you work so hard for can easily be taken so quickly and easily. And they got Mechanics say locking lug nuts can slow a thief down, but police say those are no match for a pro criminal. Police suggest parking in a garage if possible. I'm assuming they were not trying to be gentle. Austin had locking lug nuts on his car. It's a frustration more than anything else. At the end of the day, if they're coming to take something, you know, we can kind of set up all these things, but um, some, I guess some people just kind of figure out a way to, to get through them. Police recommend getting your wheels and tires engraved with your name so that if they do get stolen, they'll be easier to recover. In Southwest Houston, Chris Costa, KHOU 11 News.